I'm Gracion and I make Pokemon content from Japan. Today I am going to go and sell some of my Pokemon cards. Now I'm working on my binder. I have a few missing spaces, they're mainly Vs and Vmaxes, but it's coming on really nicely for the sets that I'm collecting at the moment. Problem is, I keep getting doubles of things. Now I say it's a problem, but really it's not so much of a problem because I can sell them. So these are the ones I'm going to sell. There's an extra one on the back there. And then I thought to myself, hold on, I've got these packs remaining. I should probably open these as well. And then any extras, I can sell those as well tomorrow. And we'll see how much money we can get for new Pokemon cards. So previously in my other video, I tried selling my older Pokemon cards. Now it is time to see how much I can get for new snazzy cards. So we'll do a little opening, see if we get any Vs and Vmax doubles. And if we do, we'll add them to the set for selling away. Now I have previously sold one of these Intellium V Maxes. Sorry about the names in Japanese, I still need to learn them in English. And I got 250 yen for him, and then they sold it for 350. So I'm thinking I would lose about a dollar's worth or a hundred yen's worth on what they will make on it. But it saves me a lot of time of having to sell these individually and posting them and packaging them and all of that I almost think I'd rather just give them to the shop get some money for them and see how we go on a side note I decided to make my own cover pages because I was getting a little bit confused about the sets that I'm collecting so this is my VMAX Rising my Mugen Zone Hangyaku Crush and also Walker set but I haven't made a cover for that one yeah so let's open some cards and tomorrow let's sell some cards these are the ones we have. We have three of those, four of those, and one of those. Firstly, I want to assure you that my table is clean. This is super glue. I like to make cosplays on this table. I have washed it down. So if you're like, ooh, why are you putting those Pokemon cards on that disgusting table? No, no, no. This is clean. I say let's do one, two, three, like a little shake it up. And I want to, and um, we'll start with that one. Um, uh, why don't we start and end the Mugen Zone, the Infinity Zone? So here we go. Oh, actually, don't have that one. Fantastic! I've started with a card I don't have. <gasps> I can see something good. Oh, I'm so excited! Oh, it's the Sunny Gone V. I already have this card, so he's going to go in my selling pile. I might not have that one either, actually. I think I've got some good cards there. Let's put him to the side for the selling and put these together for organizing after. Walker. The umbrella! I don't have that one. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I don't have the umbrella. All right, that's an okay set, but definitely I don't have that one, so I'm gonna put that to the side to add to my binder. Another infinity zone, Mugen zone. Energy. Right, not terrible, but I'm pretty sure I've got all of those. You saw my previous video opening the box, you'll see I got a lot of cards from my binder. Yep. Oh, I definitely don't have that. Is that? Yes, it is. It's one of the hidden rare cards. Cab. 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 He must have a good English name. But yes, as you can see, it's 77 out of 70. Super rare. He is a hidden rare. Fantastic. That's going in that pile. That's for reselling. And that's for, oh yeah. New cards. Another Infinity Zone. Today just so happens to be Plastic Recycling Day, so I can recycle all of these packs. Yep. 
well, that was uneventful. Oh, oh no. I thought it was a thing, but it's not a thing. It's the regular cab. Not fantastic there. Last two. Oh, the only hang yakko crush I've got left. Net. the last infinity zone mugen zone come on crowbat i really want that crowbat i'm gonna have to keep searching aren't i no oh i don't have this one that is a new one so not not a fantastic set all these ones I've already got before, but we can sell this sunny one. And these ones can be added to my collection. Fantastic. Today, our journey has taken us to Card Secret in Ikebukuro. I have heard that this place is really good for Pokemon specifically, and also that the owner might speak English. So I can speak Japanese, but sometimes it's just better to use your native language. So, card secret, let's go. So this shop is entirely Pokemon. It's absolutely amazing. Everything is Pokemon, even the clock. got cards they've got collectibles as well so if you're looking exclusively for pokemon cards come here it's absolutely awesome and the owner is australian so yes english is absolutely fine if not preferred which is awesome so i managed to sell my cards and i was well pleased <laughs> got really good price for them as well they're very reasonable when i went into card secret i also purchased two cards meaning now my v max rising collection is complete sorry about the light shine these are another set but yay i finished all of this one now they gave me such a reasonable price for these two as well. I'd seen them much more expensive in other places, but managed to complete that really cheaply. So I'm so pleased. Jajang! Still got a long way to go on this Mugen Zone. <laughs> 